Tamika cry. Hi, welcome morning guys. Hi everyone. Hi Cam. Hi Claudia, Lindsay, how are you? Crystal, okay. Crystal, Felix, hi. Thank you for the hand hearts. Thank you so much, Felix. Appreciate that. Hi, Willow, Mason. And guys, don't forget to tap your screens and share the live. Thank you guys that are sharing the live already and tapping your screens. Thank you, thank you. These ear ones are so hard to get out and it just leaves a hole behind. <laughs> Thank you so much for the hand card. Colt, thank you again for all the roses. You're the title gifter of roses. Thank you so much, Colt, for all the roses. Thank you, Lindsay, for the art me. cute. I feel so guilty that it just came like right when the possum passed though. <laughs> Can't help but feel guilty but I'm so glad that we have her at this time. <laughs> Colt, thank you so much for the roses. Thank you, thank you. Lena, Vina, hi. Oh, thank you Lexi. I appreciate that. Yeah, they don't have a very long lifespan, but you know, it's just my daughter, but that was like her best friend. <laughs> And 
him actually. <laughs> It's really relaxing. Whoever asked about the music, it's uh, something I just asked for amp or meditation music. You know, my thing. And then I kind of just skipped around until I found it. Yeah, we don't do subscription lives every single time. We just sometimes end up going into sub only mode to keep the trolling out. Thank you so much for the heart me. Oh, awesome, Jessica. Thank you. Appreciate that so much. Thank you, Jessica. Um, no, you can buy the bears on Amazon. They are up in my bio in that link tree in the Amazon storefront. Yeah, no of these. We don't make. We do reuse the cream. two videos over on my page at the top that show you how to make the pimples. Join the club. <laughs> I think a lot of us in here probably have some sort of trauma or another, you know, or a bug large percentage of us. If, I'm not going to say all of us because I know some people just come to relax because it helps them sleep and stuff, but... I'm just glad it's here for whoever needs it, you know, regardless. Sorry, I'm working with the bear that has the 
hole in the bottom. It did make that hole smaller, but it's just still there to make a noise. <laughs> Kimberly, thank you for the rose. She's on, yeah, she's down here, sleeping, very close to me. I didn't think I was going to be able to go live till Tim was finished because she was crying so much and we finally got her to go to sleep. I forgot though, you know, like training the dogs where you got to take them outside like every hour pretty much so they can go pee. Oh my gosh, I'm still using the cat without the ear. I just realized that. <laughs> you know what it's like training a, a new dog. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, it's got the sweetest little face. Like, if it hadn't been for the... F I was gonna put her on, on there to show everybody, but I was like... Then that happened with the possum, and I was like, I'll wait and show her later. But, oh my gosh, her face will melt your hearts. Oh, you're so welcome, the mama. Just, we just got her yesterday. I wasn't even going to get a puppy at all. I had already said no because, you know, we just had a dog pass and everything. And, um, oh, there's its ear again. I got tricked again. Um, but it was my daughter's friend from school and I just kind of pulled up and basically he handed this... I was in here in the house, and he just, she, uh, her and Tim were outside, and he just put the dog in her arms and got back in the car and left. <laughs> so, but after I seen the dog, I was like, it was too late. Its face was just adorable, its little wrinkles. support type pet or something maybe I did because I don't know this dog just clings to me like maybe it needed me like I needed needed her but it was awful cold out there last night She's got a nice fur coat on. Yeah, it is calming. Yeah, when you're about to sleep or can't sleep, they'll usually put you right out. to help get some of that overstimulation out, you know. Um, I'm not sure if she is just like, um, a pit bull and a boxer mix, or a boxer... Tim keeps trying to say she's like a full-blooded boxer, but I think she has a little pit bull in her. Which I think that's a good combination. The boxer would balance out the pit part, you know. Boxers are just such great dogs. Which pit bulls are too if they're, you know, properly trained and stuff. Yeah, I'm gonna show her to you guys. I mean, I probably won't show her tonight, but... She's really cute. 
cute. She's black with like little white socks and a tiny like thin wisp, so so very thin streak right between her eyes. A thin straight little line. Yes, little girl. I was naming her Remy, and I never called her that for a rifle or Remington like he's saying, but if that helps him remember it, that's fine. I wanted to name her Freya, and I swear, I kept like, every time I would try to call the dog, I couldn't remember the name. It wouldn't come to me fast enough. Uh, yeah, Jasmine, I feel you. I've had some major insomnia myself. But welcome back. Hopefully, I'll be able to get some sleep now. <laughs> Boxer pits are a good breed. This one has separation anxiety. Yeah, I can tell already. It's got major separation anxiety. I can't leave the room without it following me or crying if it thinks I'm not there. Which is really good right now. Um, I can, like, take her to the bathroom without the leash because she will come right back to me. But that's not going to last much longer. Kayla, thank you so much for the hand hearts. Number, thank you for number nine. Thank you for the roses. Thank you. Thank you so much for the hand hearts and for contributing to the live goal. Thank you, number nine, for the finger hearts. Kayla, thank you so much for the friendship necklace. Thank you. Thank you for the high bears. for the finger hearts. Thank you, number nine, for the rose. Thank you, Kayla, for the heart puffs. Too pretty for you. Thank you for the rose. You love dog. You work at doggy daycare. Yeah, I mean, I've had pure breed, um, you know, pure breeds and mutts and I mean, both have been good dogs, honestly, but the last dog we had was a boxer, and she was really good. She was just the best dog, so I just wanted something that I knew would be good for the kids, but... Kayla, thank you for the disco love. Felix, thank you so much for the cheer you up. Thank you, thank you. Yeah, they really are the best of And its face does look like a boxer puppy. It really does. It has that round, like, head with, you know, that kind of little naughty thing they have on the back of their heads. I don't know. We only have the one puppy that we just got yesterday, but we used to have um, a, a brindle colored box or boxer, and she was a pure breed. This one is mixed, I think, with pit. Kayla, thank you for the finger heart and the heart puff. do about the separation anxiety. I was thinking about that. I was like, if I have to take a trip or something, you know, um, I'll have to now take the animal with me because 
like, I don't know, when I bond with an animal like that, I can't leave them behind. I always have taken my dogs with me <laughs> if I go places. Yeah, I mean, I would like to kennel train her um, a little bit, if nothing else, to make sure that she's not, you know, going to the bathroom all over the house at night and stuff. support for real that's that's what I feel like I need her for I mean I'm not lying about that I really feel that she just seems very calm and she stays right with me I don't know I'm, and I'm not sure about like who had her before me or anything like that or nothing about the, the mom, that's another thing, is I don't know any of that. Hi, Wamed, thank you so much. Year number 1993 on the team. Kennel training, yeah. Pocket, thank you so much for the hand cards. I mean, I get it. Everybody has to do, you know, what works for. squishy um, bears. Hi Sydney, I'm so glad. Yeah, they are reusable. I mean, eventually we replace them because all these little, you know, places that you put the pimples start leaving little dots and they start looking, like, dirty. And it bugs people, so... That's really the only reason why we have to get new bears. It's not because they don't hold the pimples. We did make it just to go on live and pop it. That's what we do. <laughs> you grow your own. <laughs> hey, I did that the other day myself. Don't feel bad, man. Hey, grow my own too. Slapped a pimple patch on there though. Got rid of that bad boy. Those things were really great, man. button's not working again tonight, so I don't know how many shares or where we're at, but we're only at 48k on our tab bowl, so we still have 
quite a ways to go. Well, over halfway. Well, at least halfway to go now. 175 shares. Thank you so much. Sydney, thank you for the rose. that I get on Amazon are up in the, my link tree in my bio in the Amazon storefront. They're all there. Twyla, thank you so much for the rose. Thank you, Pam, for the rose. Hi, Cindy. This is a flower ball. Um, when it's a solid color and not like this clear jelly looking one, um, like that clear see-through stuff sort of, you can make it out a lot better. The roses are... They just look better. A solid color. Sort of kind of like those. They look a lot better when they're solid. But when they have... When they're see-through, they don't... It's hard to tell what they are. forgets when he makes color choices on the squishies that he makes. <laughs> he told me I missed the pimple the last live, that it was all the way in the center of this thing, like I would have ever known to look all the way in the middle. I know what it is, <clears throat> but I can totally get how you could be like, what is that? If you haven't seen it or you're not sure. Hi, Trinity. Something like a thick body butter would probably... That's what I always compare this stuff to. time sometimes to prepare all of it. Uh, it takes my husband about an hour and a half at least to get ready to go live. Um, it takes us all day if we're making squishies, just like replacing all the ones that we have to replace. That's sometimes a two-day process, it just depends. 
Kayla, thank you for the heart, mate. Mama, Mama, thank you for the roses. Thank you, and thank you, Cindy, for the heart, mate. Thank you so much. Thunder, thank you so much for the hand hearts. Thank you, Cindy, for those hand hearts contributing to the live goal. Thank you, guys. Thank you, Kayla, for the disco love. We have flaming hot noodles tonight. Shannon, thank you for the hand hearts. Thank you so much. A dog snoring. It almost sounds like a cat meow. Figures you did. <laughs> I was like, you don't hear that. So cute. They are a little juicy tonight. Um, tomorrow. I'll be live tomorrow night. Yeah, it's supposed to be red, definitely. He makes them red, my husband makes the pimples, so he'll make different colored ones, but sometimes people ask for them while he's live, because he makes them on the live, so. Yeah. I'm seeing a couple different colors tonight. <laughs> Thank you, Pearl, I appreciate that so much, yeah. Shock. Definitely a war. We weren't expecting that, but maybe that's why I ended up taking that puppy is, you know, God knew that was going to happen and we would need something to help. Jessica, thank you so much for the rose. And the chug, yes. After seeing those hedgehog babies, I think these are so more, and they're like way cuter now. This would be so cool if I could make their backs brown and then the inside, you know, like that fleshy color like they are when they're babies. So cute. Yeah, we've tried that and, um, you can't do like a... We haven't figured out, unless maybe if I use the uh, live studio, I bet it would probably let me do it that way then. But there hasn't been an option that would, it only shows like a small screen or like everybody's in small uh, smaller screens, unless you're battling someone. Thank you, Jamie. And um, nope, 
everyone hates it if I do any battles during the lives because I accidentally hit the battle button or accepted a battle by accident one day and it just we had to sit there and wait for like six minutes for the whole thing to be over <laughs> there's like not an option to do a battle without battling unless I just don't know how to use it I haven't used the live studio even though I have access to it because um, I have to use you have to use it on your um, desktop computer and so I will have to I need to hook up a camera because mine has to be overhead where I work with my hands I can't use that camera yeah I know it sucks to lose a pet it really does everywhere with her. She was so, she just loved him to death. Thank you, Polly Pocket, for the hand hearts. Go, lady, go. Thank you so much for the heart, me. Oh, just, um, you just DM me, and then, um, I go to my messages, and I'll accept the message. Um, daily. If it's something like really quick, it's best to put it in the comment of like a recent video that I've posted because I check those frequently too. So I'll know to like or be like, go check your DMs, you know, where I sent you a DM, and I'll be able to go check it. Because honestly, I get so much junk mail and then mail from TikTok shop things and just so much of it on a daily basis that my good mail gets lost half the time or I have to dig forever just to find it yeah I'm not on a tool one yet I'm getting ready to do a tool one thank you go lady go for the rose and wait, ooh, who sent those fireworks? We gotta go back. Construction girl, I knew that was you. <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you, appreciate that so much for the fireworks. Thank you, those were awesome. So pretty. Three gifter badge. Thank you for the hand hearts. Oh yay, that life goal got achieved. Thank you guys so much. Let me change that out. girl for the donuts thank you so much you're the title gifter uh, mochi pimple popping that's what it's called like visual ASMR as well as under that Lindsay thank you for the donuts thanks Felix for sharing the live thank you Jessica Hachi, thank you. Thunder, thank you for the donut. Oh 
both the goals? Oh my gosh, yes, you did meet both the goals. Oh, well, I can't tell about the share goal, but <laughs> awesome. Thank you, Felix. Thank you, everyone. Thank you, Sydney. Thank you. Thank you guys for sharing and tapping. I appreciate that so much. Now you guys can relax. Aubrey, thank you so much for the donuts. Aubrey, you're the new title gifter of donuts. Absolutely, it was amazing. Ashy, thank you for the heart puffs. Sharing smiles and spreading kindness, thank you for the rose. Girl, thank you so much for sending five subscriptions. It's Mo, you got a subscription. Thank you, Construction Girl. Jesse, you got a subscription. Sharing smiles and spreading kindness. You got a subscription. Miss Chrissy, you got one. And user 5920439, you got a sub too. Welcome to the family, guys. Thank you so much, Construction Girl, for growing the community. I appreciate that so much. Thank you. Welcome, welcome, everybody. Thank you, sharing smiles and spreading kindness for the heart puffs and the finger hearts. It's like that paid off. That's so awesome. This pays off. Construction Girl, thank you so much for the roses. Mr. Giggle Tickle, thank you for the heart me. You're for 1996 on the team. Thank you, Construction Girl, for the roses. You feel like the heart puffs should show on the screen? They usually do, but they don't. They used to like like make a little puff and explode and then they quit doing that now they just come up on the side like the other ones they always end up doing that with the good gifts they'll be really cute ones and then they'll end up stopping them from good. like the cheer you ups for instance they used to do something too thank you jessica for the cheer you up thank you so much it's not really fair that they do that Thank you so much for the cheer you ups. Thank you, Jessica. Mr. Giggle, thank you for the donut. For all we know, the donuts probably used to dance around. Thank you for the team bracelet, Jessica, and the heart me. Why are you ha you're having a hard day? I'm so sorry. Is it why are you? I said, why aren't you? Or why you? Sorry. I was a little dyslexic there for a minute. I can't help it. Jessica, thank you so much for the cheer you up. Construction Girl, thank you for the disco love. Good night, Sydney. Have a great night. Thank you for stopping in. it's making me think of like when I keep I've been craving that um, sesame chicken you know with rice and carrots and mushrooms but like really sauteed mushrooms the good kind that you actually want to eat yummy Jessica thank you so much for all the cheer you love and the roses thank you
I'm gonna have to get some of that tomorrow because I bet craving just won't go away. And I don't know how to make anything like that. Some people know how to make that stuff at home. I don't know if it's as good as the actual place making it, but you never know. It could be. Very well could be. This one's going to be weird. Yeah, it is a bit weird. But I just love this piece. I don't know why. It's like the Alien and the Fight Club soap. I've got to get those two made. They're like one of my favorite ones and I haven't got to see them in a, a while. forgetting that what they haven't made in a while. Bad dragon vibes. <laughs> Kinda does give a little spiky dragon vibes, yeah. It's supposed to be a spine. I know it's like de definitely smaller than like a human spine. Maybe it's just a really teeny tiny spine. The size of, I don't know. Even a cat's probably is smaller than that. I have no idea. I forgot one in there. I see it. Oh, he just came from his life. He's on the Oculus now. I hear him in there playing his game. Oh my gosh, we're only at 15 minutes left. I gotta hurry. He's good at that, putting like a bazillion pimples on here and then going and playing his game. Oh, my accent, yeah. I'm from Tennessee, so I can't help it. <laughs> Sometimes it comes out more than others. I try not to talk like too southernish, but like, I don't know, Timmer says it comes out if I'm mad or like if I get excited, it comes out. Oh, my husband's accent. Oh, yeah, his is really bad. Oh, shoot. Yeah, sorry. His is real, real bad. But. Yeah, a lot of people like it. Some don't. Oh, you're from Nashville. Okay. <laughs> Alright, well then you're around it, so you know. Also from Tennessee. Alright. Got a lot of Tennesseans in the house. I do gotta say, you know that company in Tennessee that makes the um, cake, the Lulu liquor cake? Well, I ordered, you know, three cakes from there, the pineapple upside down cake jar and like the, the 
it wasn't Tex-Mex, I told you wrong, Timory. It was called Hot Fudge Cake, and then the other one was... Oh, it was that vanilla bourbon cake. Now, vanilla bourbon smells like, for real, you could smell like straight up liquor. It was, it smelled strong. And Tim and I just tried both of them. And they're really good. The icing, the cake is like very, very moist, especially on that hot chocolate cake. And the other two didn't really have an overwhelming alcohol smell at all, but you kind of, your throat warmed a little bit as you ate it. It was kind of strange. You're from Texas? Cool. North Carolina. But um, their customer service end stinks. It is terrible. If you happen to try these liquor cakes, yes, the pineapple upside down cake was really good. And we even almost kind of felt like a little head change maybe after eating you know like a little bit of that half of that cake I know that's probably just in your head but um the cake was decent I don't know if it was worth the hype but the customer service if you have a problem or that you make a mistake with your order you forget about getting any help doesn't matter how many emails you send, how many phone calls you make, how many different social media messages you send, they are never going to call you back. So, yeah, that's going to be my review on that. Just so disappointing for a Tennessee company. I'm like, man, I can't believe that. Well, uh, let me tell you, like, you know, there was always people contacting you on, on TikTok shop for this or that, you know, we do this, we do that, but, like, so many of the shops are open, and then the very next day, shut down. It's like, there's so many, it seems to be, like, weird things, I don't know, or we'll get messages that they're shut down for violating guidelines and things so you never know who you can deal with on there to be honest I don't like to work with any shops unless they've had their shop for a really long time and they've been like established but they're not going anywhere. Ooh, Anchorage, Alaska. Hey, is that where, does it get dark there? Like, the 30 days of night type deal? I so want to visit Alaska. Even if it doesn't get dark, I really hope. I want to know, like, a good area to visit Alaska, but maybe where I could also see it get dark. <laughs> TikTok gets been where can we you watch me at? Go to YouTube or Instagram. At the same time, we'll just start going live um, on one of those platforms. I will definitely let you guys know. I have more followers, I believe, on YouTube, so we'll start there. Just follow me on YouTube. It's the exact same name, guys. Now the Instagram is underscores instead of the dots, but it's all up in my link tree, in my, um, yeah, in my bio. <laughs> Happy birthday, Laylee. Yeah, I thought I needed to tell you guys that because people misunderstood that video that I made. I don't think people are realizing they're like, oh yeah, TikTok was supposed to go away a while ago, but you know, nothing ever happened. But I don't know if everyone is getting those messages, but I'm getting messages where they're wanting you to put in your zip code and then like, it's not a hair, it's a stringy from this thing. 
but they're wanting you to contact, you know, when you put in your zip code, it directly pops up your local representative. They already have it programmed to where you can call them immediately and um, tell them to vote no on their, the ban on TikTok. Oh, I see it. On that ban on TikTok, but it's like I put in my message, you know, what my local representative said. She was basically saying that if they didn't sell to the Americans that it was gone. And it was really sad. I was like, oh no. Yeah, it's very strange for it to have it pop up in my notifications. It scared me because it's unusual for them to ask us to, you know, do that. So I was like, oh no, they must really need, like, the support. It worried me. And I was thinking, I guess we'll just go to Insta or YouTube or both. Um, not much longer. We've got seven minutes left, so I'm gonna try to pop the rest of these out really quick and get to the end ones. you guys met the tap goal and the share goal. I will always do the end pieces, you know, of course, but Rich, love, thank you for the heart me. You're never in nineteen ninety seven. Drama Queen, thank you for the heart me. S class styles, thank you for the donuts. Leah Forever, thank you for the rose. Sonia, thank you for the heart me. Kayla, thank you for the heart me. Hi, Lorena. Ashley, thank you for the donuts. How we make these, Ashley? Thank you for the donut. Thank you so much, Ashley, for all the donuts. Thank you, thank you. Thank you, Jill, for the roses. Um, you subscribe to add time. Um, you subscribe with the gold star right here. sell anything on TikTok. Um, you can DM me if there's special requests on making these, but they're, um, we only make them, you know, for people that are really serious about buying them. YouTube, I update it. There's only about four new ones to post since I last posted new ones on YouTube. Because TikTok um, deleted all of my old ones that I had saved up and needing to post. They used to keep them for three months. They would store our live replays and then just one day they post we looked on our things and it said that they were only holding them for 30 days, so we all lost all of our live replays. Every single one of them. So I've posted everything that I have except for um, the past, like, three or four lives. 
But yeah, it was really sad to lose all those live replays. Mochis that have to be retired. If we retire a mochi, we, if there's some that are like sentimental that we'll keep that we've made. But um, there's little tricks and things that we can do to make them last long, to patch them up. Oh, there's that puzzle piece. Man, I, I've seen another content creator complaining about the, having to drag this puzzle piece around for them making sure that we're not a robot. <laughs> Do I have less to do? Let me look and see. looking down at the thing. Natalie's journey, thank you for the heart me. M, thank you for the heart me. Sorry about that. I was looking to the side counting those. Oh, hi Lex. I'm glad you caught this live. doing better sending prayers your way um I try to be here every night but Sundays but I've had to cut back here recently um it's just been hard for me to make it every single night um but I, I'm trying to get back on the schedule times a week. Thank you for the heart puffs. Thank you, Ashy. Yes, we're not done until the brain is done. I don't 
cut off just because the timer stops. Good night, Ava. Good night, everyone that is going to bed. Good night. Thank you guys so much. You guys, we still have the lion and the bear, the wolf, the lurch, heart, brain, and jellyfish. Well, it's supposed to end when that time. Uh, live ends, but sometimes we go back and forth with, so sometimes I get so many subscriptions that I run out of squishies before the live ends, so I don't, I always, if you guys meet the tap goal and the share goal, I'm not gonna not finish all of the squishies, because that's what you guys tap for. And yeah, I do the subathon, but that timer kind of helps me to stay on track, too. So I don't go way over. And it helps get subscribers too. The stuff that comes out is just our kind of pimple pus. But you can use something like a lotion. Those of you that don't watch Tim's live, he's the one that makes the pimples, so it's at Tim. If you want to watch the pimples being made, follow his account. And then it'll say timothy.master.artist, but it comes up under at Tim for some reason. It's so strange. Cindy, thank you so much for the heart puffs. pores on like inside and sometimes it's just air bubbles that you can't get out but usually that jellyfish is never comes out smooth because there's it does have a bubbly texture oh gee nana thank you so much for the rosa thank you for contributing to the live goal thank you guys for all the follows. Uh, no, Timothy. They're talking about my Tim. Um, the, my husband. He makes the squishies and he makes the pimples on his live stream. And it's, his is at Tim, timothy.master.artist for those of you that want to watch that. Go follow him. He goes on about usually maybe 30... 45 minutes before I do. Somewhere around there. I try to get them on by 10.30, but it's usually about 10.45. Thank 
to Unicorn Love. I hope you're doing well. Just one of those like visual sensory exercises. I don't know. Like I always say, it's like, why do I like watching them clean them and clip the hooves? cows and donkeys and horses. I don't know, but it's soothing to me. Jay, thank you for the rosa. I don't know why I like the soap peeling either. I guess we just kind of like whatever relaxes us. Yeah, I do too. Me too, woman. It's so great. relaxing too. You started watching it and you're obsessed, I know. It's hard to quit, especially when they find like an infected one and you're like, oh no, and they clean it all up and bandage it and they put one of those like pads on there and you're like, oh good, I'm so glad they fixed it. Is that the Scottish guy? The Scotsman? Yeah. Oh, you're so welcome, Jessica. I'm so glad you like it. It's so relaxing, you know? It really is. Oh, no. They have those special um, braces that they put the cow's or horse's leg in, and when their leg's in that, they, they can't move or get hurt is designed not to hurt them. And they're in a, a stall so they can't like lunge forward, you know, and get hurt that way. Yeah, they're they're very gentle with the animals. They you can tell they really care. And if the animal shows like any grimace or sign of pain, they always will try to like numb it up and or and they'll back off. They don't hurt the animals. They're there just to relieve their pain. Ooh, yeah, rug cleaning. That is satisfying, too. I love to see, like, the dirtiest carpets in the world, and you're like, that's never gonna come clean, and then they will get it, like, a brand spanking new, and you're like, I don't know how they did that, because I can't even get, like, a grape juice stain out of mine. No matter what kind of carpet cleaner. Well, I had one good carpet cleaner that worked real good, but these people are like, they go over it like a billion times. Some of these are like rugs that have been in floods and stuff. I don't know, but they get all clean. Spider-Man ASMR, the Spider-Man. I don't know if I've seen that, but there's this one guy, I don't know, he dresses up and kind of looks a little similar, like, kind of like the Mad Hatter, maybe? But, his is pretty good. There's a couple people I like, but I never can remember their names. I'll have to start writing them down so I can give them a good shout out because there's like about two, well about five that have some really great ASMRs. Hi B, thank you so much for the team bracelets. And I mean, they'll relax you. Like I'll, I'll be nodding off when I watch them. I'm like, I mean, this should, they're so relaxing. I wish I could remember them all right now. I'm gonna borrow, I should do like a daily trigger, just like one of my favorite triggers from each of these people and tag them in it, cause that would be nice. Some of them have some really relaxing triggers that I could just listen to one of the, these triggers for about 10 minutes anyway. And then you guys can follow all of these people if you're not already following them. If you like ASMR, theirs is an annoying ASMR where it's nothing but mouth sounds and like, you know, mouth slapping 
or teeth tapping. Theirs is like actual nice relaxation noises. Tom Who, yeah, Tom Who is pretty good. I, I like him too. There's a couple of. I want to. I really want to think. Blue Friday. I seen her the other day. I like her too. I want to say Enchanted ASMR. And there was another one that was like. Um, whispering something. Man, I wish I could remember. Y'all know it when you see it, because it's just, you can't miss it. It's so nice and relaxing. Yes, and Yanni, yeah. Or, I know that's not how you say her name. It's not Yanni. It was some, it was like Yane or something, right? But yeah, she she's really good. After the wolf is the lion... And then we'll have the big bear finger popping in the brain. Oh no, I've got a blobfish left here too, sorry. skin ones on the wolf for some reason. Oh yeah, candle making. That's so relaxing to watch too. I wish I could do that. I think that would be so much fun because we used to have one of those big wax things that you could, it was big enough where you would dip your like feet or hands in it and it would like really moisturize them really good. It's like what they do at spas and stuff, but my mom had one of those wax machines and I would like play with the wax. So much fun. I would love to do candles. I haven't even got to do my diamond painting on here yet though. Or, or the reading that I wanted to do with you guys. I had so many different book suggestions that I guess we'll just have to pick one and hope everybody will like it. Shalonda, thank you for the rose. Dip your hands and feet. Oh yeah, dip your hands and feet, yep. Yeah. It smelled like peaches too, it was like really good smelling. Sorry guys, I had to put an old shirt on because that puppy is like, its teeth are so sharp it'll rip like anything you got on. But not just that. It's like super comfortable. <laughs> and I like it a lot. Hi Leah. Hi Tammy. fun. I got to do it by myself. I was gonna, I wanted to record when I do, did it, but honestly, like, I was pretty bad at it at first. I kept getting too much of the glue and my thing, and it would get all over the diamonds, so whenever I do go live and do it, you guys will just have to overlook that part, because I'm not the best at it. It's still fun to watch, and it's still relaxing, but anyway, hi, not, uh, Milana. Um, we make the big mochis. Thank you, Tammy. Nicole, thank you for the roses. Thank you, thank you. back to all of 
our regulars that stay with the family. Polly Pocket, thank you for the roses. this guy from the last live. I think it's gonna have some bubbles left. Oh, thank you, Yessie. Yeah, everybody does it a little different. They do different things. Some people do very odd things with them and I don't know. I just don't I don't watch it. I can't watch anybody else do it. I'm weird that way. Plus if you're really messy with it, like because I've been like jumped on and yelled at and like told and people have been polite and told me like, look, I don't like this. Or when you let these get too greasy, it bugs me. When you let your table get dirty, it bugs me. When you let your gloves get dirty, it bugs me. So I try to like eliminate all that stuff. And then when I see others that just like leave their whole table and their fingers are all dirty and everything's like slipping around, it, I'm like, Burr, I gotta, I can't watch. So yeah, I quit a long time ago. I haven't been able to ever watch. I can't even watch Tim's live. They give me anxiety. I come on here, I get to hang out with you guys. It relieves my anxiety and then that's good. <laughs> Looks like Nemo. I thought Nemo was orange. Does it? Some of these looked completely different depending on like, I guess you're all screens like he's yellow looking to me but like I know Tim had one that was like a weird color yesterday and but to you guys it looked completely different I missed a big pimple underneath that finger you can buy a mold making kit molds. Oh, I'm sorry. I don't have anything but the brain left after this one. That's why you gotta follow uh, Tim. He's the one that makes the pimples and has all the mochis like right there. So if you have a special request, you gotta tell him and he'll do it every time. I just got a bunch of cats too. I found a bunch of glow in the dark ones at my local my Dollar Tree of all places. I couldn't believe it because cats are hard to find anyway. Especially the little glow in the dark ones. So yeah, y'all check your Dollar Trees because I've been finding some cute little ones there like at the register area when, where you check out. Um, I'm just watching other visuals like this has helped me. It helped my PTSD and my anxiety so much that I wanted to do it to help myself and help others. noticed how much it made a difference for me. And I know it doesn't work for everyone and that's fine, but like for the people it does work for, you know, that's great.
believe that's the one you were talking about. I don't think I missed any more. I messed around. I couldn't find any others, but... for subscribing that keeps us going it really does help out so much so thank you guys and we did drop the sub price yeah I don't know why um, sometimes I'm on the for you page and sometimes it's like they I'm being shadow bananaed, I don't know. That's why I just say I, you know, just look me up and I've put a bunch of new videos out. There's been a bunch out for a while. And there's a bunch out on YouTube as well of library plays. Thank you, Michelle, for the disco love. But anyway, yeah, there's live replays for those of you that need them. And I will be back tomorrow night at 11 30. So I love you guys, and you guys have a great night. for all the roses. Hi, Trump. Thanks, little mama. Good night, Alexia. comfy Alexia I'm having sleep issues myself but hopefully the, I'm hoping this dog will sleep tonight and let me get some rest <laughs> alright bye guys thank you all so much have a great night I love you all good night thank you to the mods and the silent mods Good night. Bye, guys.